Hello guys, thanks for joining. Today we'll be introducing the Yearling Microsoft Teams room on Android. Before we get started, I would like to share some of the keywords of the solutions. Android-based, native Teams, and all-in-one device. It is very easy to deploy, very easy to use, and you support the AI features like auto-framing and speaker tracking. Now let's get started. Before we go to the details, I would like to point out the main differences between 820 and 830. The 820 is designed for the huddle space and small size meeting rooms, while the 830 is designed for the medium sized rooms. Compared with 820, 830 built in with dual eye camera, one for detection and the other one for the video output. This can ensure the video quality in a larger room with more people. Here you can see all the items in the box. We already provide everything you need to set up the meeting room, even a wall mount just in case you want to mount the touch panel on wall so you don't need to purchase any additional items to set up the room. How easy to deploy the device is always one of the key factors when people are evaluating a meeting room solutions. So here I would like to go through how we can easily set up Yelling A30 as an example. Let's first take a look at the interfaces of the bar. We have a DC port here to support the power, and we have two HDMI ports to support the dual display, and we have an internet port for the network. Both of 820 830 support the Wi-Fi feature, but we do recommend the customer to use the wired network in consideration of a more stable network during the meeting. Besides, we have a VCH port here for the functionalities like the wired content sharing, and if the customer is looking for any external audio solutions, this is where to connect the external mic. There are two USB ports on the side of the 830, one on 820, this is where to pair with the Yearling wireless presentation pod WPP20 and connect to any external mouse, keyboard, and touch display. Now, let's talk about the camera of the bar. One of the differences between Yearling meeting bar and others is the lens cap. While the camera is in use, the lens cap will open, and if the meeting ends or the camera is not in use, the lens cap will be closed automatically, so the user will make sure that they are not being watched. We can control the camera manually, or we can enable the AI features like auto framing and speaker tracking to increase the overall meeting experience. Let's see what happens if we enable the auto framing feature. As you can see, the AI camera will identify how many people are in the room and find the best frame to include all the people. Let's test the scenario where more people come into the room during the meeting. Hi, Sherry, could you please come in? As you can see, the camera will act quickly when the condition changed in the room. Let's see what happens if we change the camera mode to speaker tracking. The camera supports the voice print recognition. Let's say, if I keep speaking during the meeting, the camera will know I'm the speaker and zoom into me. If other people start speaking, the camera will quick react and zoom into them as well. Hey Aaron, say something. Okay, my turn to speak now. Well, you may notice that the camera could easily recognize my voice and focus on me. It definitely would be helpful in different scenarios. This is just a simple test about our smart camera of meeting bar. Put it in a real situation, for instance, only few people participating in the meeting. Auto framing could totally satisfy the needs. As for meeting with more people, the speaker tracking feature ensures the camera focus on the presenter, which would absolutely improve the meeting experience. In this part, I would like to introduce the Yearling Unique Wireless Content Sharing Solution by using the Wireless Presentation Pod WPP20. By using WPP20, um, you can simply plug in the WPP20 into the PC and press the button to share the content wirelessly. Um, this can be used during the meeting or locally. This will help people to present their content from anywhere in the meeting room. If there are many people in the room, People who sit at the far end of the room may not be seen clearly. In this situation, using the multi-focus framing feature, the camera will provide an individual frame to each person, and you help the other side clearly seeing everyone's face in the room. Hi everyone, thanks for joining us today. I would like to give you a quick introduction of MVC640. MVC640 is designed for medium room. It comes with a UVC84 4K camera and use the M-Speech as audio device. And I'm holding M-Speech on my hand right now. And M-Speech is jointly developed by Yearling and Microsoft Smart Voice Team. It has built-in three microphone arrays to pick up the 
conference audio significantly. The 6 plus 1 microphone on the top provides the voice recognition feature, including voice transcription, real-time translation, and Katana voice assistant. Besides, its built-in for WHD speakers provide crystal clear audio for the meeting room. M-Speech can provide users with a high-quality audio experience. I'll show you the Microsoft AI feature like Microsoft Katana and Microsoft Transcription during meeting. Please follow me. Hey Katana, join the meeting for me. Joining your 12 p.m. Hey Viola, good to see you today. How are you? Hi guys, I'm doing great. How are you? I'm good, thanks. Please wait for a minute. Okay. Hey Kotana, invite Kate to the meeting. Which Kate should I add? The third one. Adding Kate Joe. Hi Kate, how are you today? Hi Edward, I'm good, how are you? I'm good, thanks. Actually, we are doing a test now. Okay, which part are you testing now? Um, we are doing a test for M-Speech, and I really appreciate for joining. Hey Kotana, end the meeting. Okay, I'll end the meeting. You can use the M-Speech to do the meeting control. You can mute or unmute M-Speech, as well as adjusting the volume. I appreciate your time today. After watching live demo for MVC 640, I believe you have witnessed the powerful function of M-Speech. With the effect of COVID-19, most users will prefer a touching-free meeting scenario. Apparently, M-Speech is an optimal design to meet our requirements. Being the next intelligent speaker of Microsoft, Yelling has included MSpeech in two bundles, MVC320 and MVC640, and will be dedicated to developing more and more meeting devices for different kinds of scenarios.